The global shift towards square ammo fighting vehicles has driven many nations to re-evaluate their military capabilities, leading to the development and adoption of more mobile and versatile platforms. Among these is South Korea's KW-1 Scorpion, a cutting-edge armor personnel carrier designed and produced by Hyundai Rotem. As the prime contractor for South Korea's K-1 and K-2 main battle tanks, Rotem has leveraged its expertise to create a vehicle that not only meets the needs of the Republic of Korea Army, but also holds significant export potential. The KW-1 Scorpion was conceived in response to South Korea's need for a modern indigenous APC that could operate effectively in diverse combat environments. Development began in 2012, with the project reaching completion by 2016. The KW-1 is available in two configurations, a 6x6 model designated K806 and an 8x8 variant known as the K808. Both models share a common design philosophy, but are tailored to different operational requirements. The KW-1 is powered by an indigenous Hyundai Motor Company DSR engine, capable of delivering 420 horsepower. This power plant is mated to a 7-speed automatic transmission system, providing the vehicle with impressive mobility both on and off-road. The KW-1 can achieve road speeds exceeding 60 miles per hour and has an operational range of up to 500 miles, allowing it to keep pace with the main fighting force. One of the standout features of the KW-1 is its amphibious capability. The vehicle is equipped with a pair of water jets located at the lower rear corners of the hull, enabling it to traverse water obstacles at speeds of over 6 miles per hour. This amphibious quality is a key asset for operations in regions with challenging terrain, including rivers and marshes. The KW-1 Scorpion is designed with a focus on protecting its crew and passengers from various threats. The vehicle's armor provides protection against small arms fire up to 7.62mm caliber and anterior shrapnel. The all-welded armor construction can be supplemented with additional armor plates to enhance protection levels. However, as an APC, the KW-1 is not intended for a direct engagement with heavily armed army forces. Instead, it is optimized for troop transport and support roles. The KW-1's primary armament is a 40mm automatic grenade launcher mounted in a remote weapon station on the vehicle's roof. This is complemented by a 7.62mm machine gun for additional firepower. The remote weapon station allows for weapon operation from within the safety of the vehicle, reducing the risk to the crew. Alternative armament options include a 30mm auto cannon or a 12.7mm heavy machine gun and a manned turret can be fitted in place of the remote weapon station if required. Additional defensive measures include smoke rally structures for obscuring the vehicle's movements and hard nuclear, biological, and chemical protection suit. The KW-1 is also equipped with run-flat tires, ensuring that it can continue to operate even if the tires are damaged. The KW-1 Scorpion's design prioritizes versatility, allowing it to fulfill a wide range of battlefield roles beyond that of an APC. 
The vehicle can be configured as a fire support platform, air defense vehicle, command post, anti-tank guided missile carrier, or even as a medical evacuation vehicle. This adaptability makes the KW-1 an attractive option for military forces seeking a manned hydron vehicle that can be quickly reconfigured to meet changing operational needs. The KW-1's Scorpion's combination of mobility, protection, and versatility positions it as a strong candidate for export to ally nations and global defense markets. As more countries seek to modernize their armor vehicle fleets with wheel platforms that offer both strategic and tactical flexibility, the KW-1 is poised to meet this demand. Its amphibious capability and ability to operate in various environments make it particularly suitable for regions with diverse and challenging trains. Moreover, the KW-1's modular design allows for customization to meet the specific needs of different countries, further enhancing its export appeal. The vehicle's potential roles in fire support, air defense, and command and control operations make it a valuable asset for any military force looking to enhance its operational capabilities. In conclusion, the KW-1 Scorpion represents a significant advancement in South Korea's armor vehicle capabilities, offering a versatile and modern platform for the Republic of Korea Army. With its strong performance characteristics, adaptability, and potential for customization, the KW-1 is well positioned to find success in both domestic and international markets. As the global demand for wear AFVs continues to grow, the KW-1 Scorpion stands out as a formidable option for militaries seeking a reliable and adaptable armor vehicle.